Here's the mail, it never fails. It makes me wanna wag my tail. When it comes, I wanna wail. Hello everyone, today I am here to do another little haul video and we're going to be featuring Pink Bowties, one of my favorite, favorite, favorite um, sticker shops, and Dotty Moo, which is a new addition to my collection. Um, I did shop with Dotty Moo during the Planner Boss Collective sale, um, and then my haul with Pink Bowties was just when she reopened her shop on her own website so she's now off Etsy and now has her own website which is just pinkbowties.net so let's get right into it we're probably gonna get started with the stickers first and then we'll head off into the accessories mm -hmm. so the first sticker that I have here is uh, just the freebie that came with my order from pink bow ties and uh, she tends to give a little sticker um, as a freebie with her stuff so next up I guess first item that I ordered is Jo. Now, um, I'll just give you guys a little brief overview of her shop. I'm going to zoom out while I do that. Um, so her shop is pretty much a doll, sticker doll shop. And what that is, is she does custom dolls of people. So you, um, every now and then she opens up a list. You get on a wait list and usually only stays open for a day, sometimes less. Uh, you get on the list and... Um, she kind of just goes in order, and when she reaches out to you, you send her your photo, an outfit of your choice, and then she produces a sticker for you. It's pretty simple. And then she also just does other stickers um, that she lists in her shop that aren't customs. A lot of the customs also end up on the shop. Um, so that just kind of gives you an overview of how it goes. If you want to get on her list for the next time, uh, you can follow her on Instagram at Pink Bow Ties. Um, and... Um, yeah, the next time, and turn on your notification, obviously, for her shop, so that the next time that she does open up a list, you can be notified and get on that list immediately. Um, anyways, so that was my rant on how her shop goes. So first sticker is Joe. Now, I don't know which ones of these are customs and which ones are the ones that she just put on her shop. There are some that I know because I just know the people in semi-real life, as in, like, I know them through Instagram and stuff. Um, so those people, I will point out to you which ones are customs and if I remember the person's Instagram handle I'll also share that with you so you can kind of see how they look in person and how they look on their sticker um okay so Joe I love Joe's bag like is that bag not just the cutest thing I'm gonna zoom in on that for you like, just a cute little bag and the mug oh my gosh my planner girls we went crazy over that mug last Christmas um, it was a Starbucks um, anniversary edition mug and I was able to snag one for myself and I bought a few for other planner girls I knew out in the States who couldn't find any um, but it is a super super gorgeous mug I'll zoom in really close for those who've never seen it so there so that's a real close-up shot of the mug is that not just the cutest mug oh I love it and then I'll give you guys just a zoomed in of that bag gorgeous gorgeous bag um, so yeah that's the uh, First sticker for Joe. Next up is Candace. Now I just love Candace's dress. It's so gorgeous and summery and um, yeah, just a really, really pretty dress. Kind of makes me want to go on vacation. I feel like I talk about vacation a lot. Can you guys tell I need one? Um, yeah, just a really gorgeous summer, flow summer flowy, flowery dress. And then next we've got Yvonne. And Yvonne is super, super cute. She's more of like a fall look is what I'd say she is. She has the, I think that's the Kate Spade planner. It looks a lot like it, which is, and I know this because I have one. Um, and I love just her shoes. And I have a pair of shoes like that. So I have a personal connection to like red booties. I love that with the matching sweater and the long necklace. I'm a big fan of long necklaces. So this is just like me right there this is how I would love to dress in the fall then we've got Vandissa love her chucks I love the yellow chucks like I really want to own a pair of yellow chucks I think they are super cute um and as I say this I'm going to make this my mission to get a pair of yellow chucks yeah I'm gonna make that a mission but anyways I really love this as well I love the outfit I love her working on her laptop just super cute and super happy and we've got Tiffany. Is that skirt not just the most fabulous skirt you've like ever laid your eyes on with that bow in front? Oh my gosh. 
it speaks absolute gorgeousness to me. Like I just love everything about the skirt. Um, and I love her earrings too. Let's not forget that. Like just the little details of the little details of the outfits and stickers really get to me. Um, like those earrings, really, really pretty earrings. Love the sweater and those shoes. Gosh, those shoes are gorgeous. Now I will add that these stickers are printed on like the buttery matte um, paper. Um, yeah, so anyways, we've got this one, the misses. Not the misses, the misses, okay? Um, I'm in a relationship with my bed. And on the pillow, it says, come here, and it says, lay your head here. Really cute. I love the, like, blouse with the one button on and the bra and just, like, the red bottom shoes on. I'm going to zoom in again for the details for you guys. I am all about the details. Shoes and even like the crease in the bed from her leg. Oh, I am all about the details. Absolutely gorgeous. I can love her nail polish color. I notice all of these things, which is why I just love these stickers so much. Next up is the Mika. Really gorgeous dress there as well. Like lovely pattern. I love the hairstyle. It makes me miss the days when I had my hair. Um, straightened and like permed and stuff which I don't anymore but it makes me miss those days then we've got Tara I love her sweater sorry Emily that didn't want to come that's me to a lot of things and the best part is that introverts unite yep I am such an introvert when it comes to like especially like large group outings not a fan I love my one-on-ones like I will be at a one-on-one -on, -one on time but you ask me to come to something with like a large group of people, eh, I might be late. <laughs> and we've got Riri. Happy girls are the prettiest. Yes, they are. Um, I didn't even really want this, but I was just like, how can I not? Like, the outfit is gorgeous. I'm not a big Rihanna, like, fan or anything. But the outfit is just like, how could I not, right? Then we've got Rashida. I love her hair. I love, love her hair color. I wish I could dye my hair that color, but I am just not brave enough to try it. I am afraid it will look terrible on me. And um, once you do that, there's kind of like no going back unless I cut off my hair. Or, you know, like you, got, you have to let it grow out. So I'm really afraid, but I wish I could dye my hair that color. I think it is so gorgeous. And it looks so fabulous on her with her outfit. It's just such a complimentary color. Um, I didn't give you guys a full scope of the outfit, so I'll zoom out a little bit. So there we have a full scope of Rashida's outfit. Then we've got Pasha. Now she's one that I know is a real person slash custom doll. Um, her Instagram is uh, Posh Plans. It's her um, plan in Instagram. So that's P-O-S-H Plans. Um, so that's her custom doll. And I think it's just such a, it looks a lot like her in my opinion. And then we've got, excuse me while I glow for a minute, me! That's me! Can you believe it? Look at me. Am I not fabulous? <laughs> I'm joking guys, but no, seriously, I loved this. So this was an outfit. So I um, sent her this photo, actually, that my husband took of, took of me at a wedding we went to last summer. And I loved that dress because I never thought I'd be able to fit in it after having my son. And I was able to fit in it for the wedding. And I was just like, what? Work it, girl. Work it, work it, work it, girl. And then my hair that day was just like, it was such a hack job because what happened was we flew down. The wedding was in um Shreveport, Louisiana. So we flew down there. I had my hair done like pre-twisted at home on the flight. Um, I wore like a hoodie over it. So it shrunk down a lot and I was just like, ooh, okay. So then the night before the wedding when we were at the hotel, I spent all night like retwisting my hair and all of this. And then woke up in the morning and the humidity in Shreveport hit me. My hair was just not what I needed it to be. So I grabbed all the bobby pins I came with and I came up with that hairstyle.
and it worked out fabulous with my outfit like just mm. anyway so yes I do love my outfit if I'm if I may say so myself I must zoom in for you guys to see the details my jewelry that day was from um, Charm and Charlie actually um, I loved that necklace and earring set so gorgeous and my glasses they were gold but that's okay we'll let it all be silver my jewelry is usually gold but that's all right it works well to be silver for this photo um, and then my bracelet and then my purse and this was my watch on this arm <laughs> it's like a black band but yeah that was my watch and then my shoes and my toes were all done I was looking cute that day guys um, but anyways, I love the details and I, my eyebrows. Look at those eyebrows. I don't have eyebrows like that in real life. My eyebrows are super thin, damn near non-existent. But I'm glad they gave me a little eyebrow in this photo. <laughs> of course, if you want to buy my sticker, I am listed on her shop. Just saying. I don't get any, like, money or anything from it, but it's just cool to see other people have their stickers. Um, then we've got Pam. This is also a real person. Um, I don't know her Instagram name though, unfortunately. Um, but she is a friend of the shop owner. Um, and I love that she's got the Copic marker and like just fabulous in her lovely like runners and yeah, super, super cute. Next up is Raquel. I feel like this is a real person because I'm trying to remember when she put this sneak peek up on her Instagram, but I don't know if it's a real like custom doll or just one that was made up or not um, It's funny because like I like her white outfit, but it's a little too white for me It's just I almost want to take my marker and color it in. I feel like she needs a pop of color I'm all about a pop of color. So I feel like you know, give me Heck if that purse was like a red purse or something like or just like the lapel of that blazer if it was like a black is it a lapel no it's not called a lapel is it oh my brain's like gone on me right now but yes if that were black right there just need a little bit more contrast to it um but it's still a cute outfit just i wish i had a little bit more color for my taste but it's not my doll so that's why i don't really get a say in these things aisha she's a real person she's a uh, at planner girls rock and i believe girls is g-u-r-l-z so Planner Girls Rock. I think that's her Instagram. So she's a real person as well. I love her sweater. Queens recognize queens. Yes, we do. I see you, girl. Um, then we've got Erin. I mean, something about black and red just speaks to me. I don't know what it is, but something about that color combination is just like, Hello, is it me you're looking for? I can't sing. But, like, does this outfit not just scream gorgeousness to you guys because it does to me like the mug black girl magic that purse that gold chain on it and her like scarf lips to match bracelet and nails to match like come on and those shoes come on girl I mean, something about black and red just gets me. I think it is just such a classy, classy combination. Then we've got Wonder Woman, girl power, girl power. Diana Prince is what it says. Um, so, yes, it's Wonder Woman. Um, love her outfit. I had to get it because I just have a thing for Superman and Wonder Woman and a whole lot of, like, cartoon superheroes, Marvel to be specific. Um... I think she's just fierce, like she's a bad, just, I'm a bad mamma jamma. That's what we're going to call her. Love it. Then we've got Wendy, who is just dripping swag. Like her walk, she is dripping swag. And I love the like saying on her shirt, I am my ancestors' wildest dreams. Like she is here to slay. And that's honestly why I got this to I, I look at her face, the intensity, the fierceness, her like walk pose, her hand placement. She's just like slay girl. I dare you to come for me, slay. I mean, look at her face. If that's not fierce, I don't know what is. Oh yeah, and that's her Instagram handle, Pink Bow Ties 2014. Um, but yeah, like just she slays. I love her. Love all the details. The shoes, not a big fan, but 
it's still like she still slays I'm just not a fan of like Uggs just don't like them um, but she slays in them so kudos to her next up we've got our black girl power girl power um super fierce kind of a Wonder Woman look there but she's bad and she knows it I love the fro the power of the fro just just hone it in hone it in <laughs> we've got this which just is my relationship that's my marriage um it's not actually like me and my husband but that's how yeah I, I love it I think it's such a amazing sticker I was so glad when she did it so I, I think I own like three or four of it um because it just it's so me and like his hand placement his her like we got each other boo we got each other and I love her hair oh that hair I wish my twist out would come out like that more often but anyways I love it we've got Robin you guys ready for Robin though he, are you guys ready here to slay and slay she does here to slay and slay she does that is what I got to say about her so let's just look at the full she look at that full she guys her outfit fabulous completely completely fabulous oh love the dress again I told you guys already something about red and black gets me going and this is gorgeous then we've got my emoticons. So I ordered two, three, and four of these. I already have one. Um, so she had four sets of it. Um, so one and two were both like with the crown. Three and four are without a crown. And if my memory serves me right, they're the exact same thing. So like two and three are the same ones, just with the crown, ones without a crown. Um, so I'm not gonna really look and show you guys all that detail but you kind of get the idea they're just yeah emoticons and then we finish off her stickers with these so she had added a new artist to her um, shop and she draws draws more in watercolor and honestly guys so when I saw these on Instagram I wasn't a big fan I was like eh but after it got to me I was like damn I wish I got my because I just had another order of custom stickers put in and I kind of wish I got it done in watercolor. Like, these look really gorgeous in person. I wasn't a big fan of what I saw on the computer, but in person, I, I'm real mad that I didn't get one. So next, next time around, I'll ask her for a watercolor one. Because I think this is fabulous. Avery is gorgeous. Look at her skirt. Details, details, the details of life. And that YSL bag. That hair, pff, that hair, oh gosh. And I love the saying. I think that is just what everyone needs to, yeah, be you, do you, boo. Then we've got Donietta, and she's a kind of a cheerleader for, is it Georgia State? I don't know if it's Georgia State. I don't really know my American universities that much because I'm not American, but. Anyways, she's still cute. That's why I got her. And then Yunetta. Again, swag. Swag all the time is what these girls are. That hat. I'm a girl who loves, like, I love those types of hats in the summer. I always try to get one that I use every summer. Um, like, one for the summer, I mean. Um, and that I love. I really want to get a white one after seeing this. I don't own any white hats. Um, but that is a really pretty one. So anyways, that takes care of our pink bow ties stickers. Now, I was going to do Dotty Moo, but I feel like that was a really long video. So what we're going to do, I'm going to end this video here, and then I'll just kind of pick up again and do Dotty Moo as a separate video so that we can kind of take a break between the two. But anyways, that's it for pink bow ties. Check her out on Instagram at pinkbowties2014. Her name's Lamika. She's an awesome, lovely young lady. Um, so, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.